ಎಲ್ಲರಿಗೂ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಉಡಾನ್ ಪೇಪರ್ ಯೂಟ್ಯೂಬ್ ಚಾನಲ್ ನಾವು ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸಿಂಗ್ ದಿ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಮ್ಯಾಥ್ಸ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಪೇಪರ್ ಆಫ್ ನೈನ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡರ್ಡ್ ಮಿಡ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಮಿನೇಷನ್ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಂಬರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಸೊ ಲೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಬಿಗಿನ್ ಅವರ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಶನ್ ಆನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸಿ ಮಿಡ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಮ್ ಸೆಪ್ಟೆಂಬರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ನೈನ್ ಎಸ್ ಸಿ ಸೆಟ್ ಬಿ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಸಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಮ್ಯಾಥಮೆಟಿಕ್ಸ್ ಮಾರ್ಕ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇ ಟೋಟಲ್ ತ್ರೀ ಅವರ್ಸ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ಸ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ರೀಡಿಂಗ್ ಅಂಡ್ ತ್ರೀ ಅವರ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ರೈಟಿಂಗ್ ದೆನ್ four alternatives are given for each of the following questions or incomplete statements choose the appropriate one right along with the alpha bits okay so in the uh, eight questions you will get and one mark each so pi is what so i discuss the answers here pi under here pi is what pi is the irrational number then put kobeku pi one is what irrational number then the degree of polynomial what is degree degree means what highest power of x so the number which is on the highest power of x we call it as degree so how much it is so uh, highest power of uh, x is what 5 so the answer is option d the coordinate of point on y axis is so you know if the point is on y axis x is equal to 0 so if you know, point what it is it is on the y axis so x will become what 0 so where x is 0 here x is 0 is here x is 0 is here so this two are wrong now if that y axis should be there so this is the right one because this is y coordinate so here y should come so this one also will be wrong then the standard form of linear equation in two variables so linear equations has only two letters that is x and y so here ax plus bx by plus c equal to 0 so this is the standard form of the pair of linear you should not pair linear equation in two variables okay then how many straight line can be drawn through two points so from two points you can see how many straight line you can draw only one so the answer is what one because two points if you are having then only one line you can draw that two straight line they are there okay then moving to the next one that is question number 6 p of what minus uh, 2 comma 3 is uh, lies at hash quadrant so you know which quadrant it is so you should know the quadrant okay so suppose this is first quadrant this is second this is third but you can uh, this is fourth so this is both are positive here x is negative y is positive here both are negative x is positive, y is negative. Now, uh, minus, matthu, plus are here. Okay. So, minus and plus where it is, it is in the second quadrant. So, the right answer is option B. Okay. Like this, you should be able to solve this one. Some of adjusted angles of a straight line. Suppose this is a straight line and suppose one line is uh, what uh, intersecting. Then, uh, uh, then the sum of these two adjusted angles is how much? 180 degree. So, the, uh, this is linear pair. Zero of the polynomial. So, how to find zero? See, phi x minus is equal to zero, you write. Take 2 here, phi x is equal to 2 will come. So, x is equal to 2 by 5. So, which option will give you 2 by 5? That is only option A. Okay. I hope you got this one. Now, coming to the one mark question. Okay. So, if you are finding it helpful, kindly like, share and subscribe so that I can come up with more such initiatives. Okay. So, let me begin with solution of the uh, question number 9 onwards. So, define rational number. What are rational numbers? The numbers which can be expressed in the form of P by Q. So, those numbers which you can express in the form of P by Q, we call it as what? They, those are rational numbers. Then, in the next question is what? Three, uh, you should rationalize this or you should simplify this. So, here the, all are roots. I mean, see, all roots are common. Take the common out. So, root 5 here in the, you take outside. Then, what will remain? 3 plus 7 minus 1. So, how much it is root 5? 7 plus 3 is 10. 10 minus 1 is 9. So, answer in, uh, what will come? It is 9 root 5 will be your answer. Then, write the degree of cubic polynomial. So, you know, linear polynomial 1, quadratic polynomial is 2, cubic polynomial is 3. So, answer is what? Degree is equal to 3. So, how to write? You should write. Okay. How to write degree equal to 3 is the answer. Write the coefficient of x square. So, what is the coefficient of x square? The number beside x square equal to coefficient of x square. The coefficient of x square is how much? Minus 5. That is the answer. Then define example. What does example one say? Things which are equal to same thing are equal to one another. So, like that, that all the exams and postulates, definitions you should remember. Okay. So, let's come into question number 14. X five. What is x cube minus y cube? x cube minus y cube is x minus y. x square plus x y plus y square. So, this formula you should by heart. Okay. So, there is no other option. You cannot, uh, you, you can only recall, recall it only when you use it frequently. Okay. Find the value of x in adjacent figure. So, if x and the uh, what, for value in the you should find. 
ओके ठीक है व्हाट विल कम दिस इज अ स्ट्रेट लाइन एंड यू नो दैट दिस एंगल एंड दिस एंगल आर व्हाट एडजसेंट एंगल्स बिकॉज़ ए पी बी इज अ स्ट्रेट लाइन सो ए पी बी इज अ स्ट्रेट लाइन विल कम देन हाउ टू सॉल्व दिस वन सो दिस एंगल ए पी क्यू ए पी क्यू प्लस क्यू पी बी व्हाट विल कम इट विल कम 180 डिग्री व्हाई इट विल कम 180 डिग्री बिकॉज़ देयर इज लीनियर पेयर ओके नाउ यू सी ए पी बी इज हाउ मच इट इज एक्स It is 55 equal to 180 degree. So x is equal to 180 minus 55. So it is 135. Sorry, it will be 125. 125. So if you yes, so it will be 125 degree. So x is what? How much it will be? 125 degree. It will be. Then here find the value of x in the adjacent figure. The adjacent figure is given here. Now that is figure two. Then you should find the value of x. You know this. This angle A, C, and E, D, E, B are equal. Why they are equal? X is equal to 65 degree because vertically opposite angles. If you write this much, you will get one mark. Okay. So I hope I have solved all the questions. Now coming to the next one. Okay. For express 0.33 in the form of d by q. See this uh, two mark, three mark questions I will be solving in subsequent uh, sessions. So I will just you just go through the question paper thoroughly so that you can answer them and practice them well in one session. Okay. So in subsequent videos I will be solving them. Okay. So you may note down to question number seventeen. Express 0.33 in the form of p by q. Find the four rational numbers between three and four. You should factorize. Twelve x square minus seven x plus one. So middle term splitting method you should use. Find the product of three x plus four, three x minus five using suitable formula. Expand three y plus two q using suitable identity. So a plus b the whole cube formula you should use. Write the coordinate of point A and B in the adjacent graph sheet. So A is what? A is you can see two, two comma three, and B is minus four comma two. So directly you should take the use the graph and you should write. Then check the zero comma minus two is the solution of the equation. So in place of x right zero y minus two, whether LHS and RHS are equal, you should capable to find. Define postulates in one example. Then this one graph question will come directly. That is root three on number line. That is one figure based question. So root three, root two, root five, these are fixed. Okay. Rationalize the denominator. So you should use rationalizing factor. Just change this sign. Find the value of k if x minus one is a factor of four x cube plus three x cube minus four x plus k. Factor is twenty seven m cube plus one twenty five m cube using suitable identity. If x is equal to one, y is equal to two. Is a solution of equation a x to a square x plus y y equal to three. Then find the value of a. State any three axioms in the figure three. You can find this. You should uh, if p q R is equal to P R Q. Then you should prove that P Q is equal to P R T. I already explained directly from test two. You should be can able to solve. Then in figure four, if A B is parallel to C D, already there is such A P B. This A P Q is 50 degree. P R D P R D is 127 degree. You should find X and Y. I in this uh, figure uh, five is given here. Okay. So in figure five, you can just see. Uh, QP is perpendicular to PS. Okay, QP is perpendicular to PS. PQ is parallel to SR. And SR is 28 degree. So SQR is 28 degree. QRT, QRT is 65 degree. You should find the value of x and y again directly from the question. So you expand using suitable identity. A plus B plus C the whole square. A square plus B square plus C square plus 2 AB plus 2 BC plus 2 CA. So directly you you should by heart the formula. You should able to write it. Then plot the following points on the graph paper. Very important. Four points will fetch you four marks. Find the four different solutions of the product of the equation x plus two y equal to six. So you should put x is equal to zero, x is equal to one, x is equal to two, x is equal to three. Any four numbers in place of x you put. Subsequently, you get the value of y. In the figure last one, that is six. You can find it here. If AB is parallel to CD, if AB is parallel to CD, and PS is a transversal, okay, and CR is equal to 75. Find the remaining angles. Remaining is all the angles. So this one will be 75. So one angle is given. All the other angles you can able to find by using the properties of parallel lines, vertically opposite angles, adjacent angles, and alternate angles. Okay. Then factorize. So five mark one question. X cube minus b x square minus nine x minus five. You should factorize for five mark. Okay. So I will be solving this in subsequent section. If you are finding it helpful, kindly like, share, and subscribe. If you are having any questions, kindly put it in the comment box below so that I am glad to answer all your questions. Okay. Thank you and take care. All the best.